For this assignment, for the ELD conference goal sheet, you'll have to have opened your Power School uh, window so to be able to check for your old ELD WIDA access scores. Here's the first step. You want to plug in your name. So right here, student name. If you look at the instructions right here, it tells you what to do. Write your name on the line for one. ELD class time. For example, if you're in ELD 9.3, uh, period three, then you plug that in right here. You already have your teacher's name here. Now for language domain, you're going to go to Power School, click on test scores, click 2019 to 2020 WIDA access scores. Okay, then here, plug in your scores for each of these domains. So you'll have to check for the listening proficiency level, speaking proficiency level, reading proficiency level, writing proficiency level, and overall is going to be your composite. So whatever you have for your composite score, that'll be in the overall score. Your growth target will be plus one. So if you, for example, got a 2.3 in your listening, you want to at least aim for a 3.3 this following year. If you scored a 4.3, five in the speaking you want to reach for a 5.5 next this year uh, and so on so each of these you're going to add one point for your growth target for the strength section you're going to identify the language domain that you scored the highest so let's say usually listening is one of the highest let's say you scored a perfect six my best skill is listening my second best skill is whatever your second is and your third, and that's what you're listing here for your strengths. Your area of focus is going to be the weakest one, whichever you did the poorest in. So usually that varies, but let's say your writing is your weakest area. So then you would put here my weakest language domain was writing. My goal is to score. So whatever you said you wanted to score here, that's what you plug in here. What can you do to meet this goal? So if you click here, here are some ideas. And I don't know if this shows up for you, but if it doesn't, here is what you could put in. Here are some ideas. So the reading, maybe what you can do is read all of the text. Increase fluency by reading faster. Um, writing is what we chose, so we're gonna look here write complete sentences, use proper end marks, identify sources for all information and pictures from a source that is not mine. So here are some ideas for what to plug in there. Use these ideas, take a screenshot of this so that you can plug in your goal, what you can do to meet your goal. And then for what my teacher can do, this is up to you. What can I do to support you in your English language development so that you are scoring and reaching your growth target this school year? The last part is the date. So just plug in here, please, the today's date so that I have evidence of this. You must complete this. You cannot move on to the recording and I will not open folders for the, for the rest of the week until you complete this assignment in its full capacity. Um, this is super important. It's important for documentation and it's important for me to provide uh, to the district office. So make sure you get this done and you do it well, okay?